Hello, everyone. By which I mean all ten of you, I think. Anywho, doing another Heroes of the Storm game. This time, Chen, who I truly feel is the most underrated hero in the whole game. Almost nobody plays him, and he's a very, very good frontliner. Normally, I go Q build, but in this game, I'm going to go a little something different because we are seriously lacking damage, and we are not la lacking chase potential. basic idea is to throw out as many flame breaths as I can. You, um, you want to take that? Oof. Just blocking. Just blocking. If that had been a combo, it might have killed him. To learn to pick ourselves up. They gotta rotate more, but... A death for an entire wall is not a bad thing. I was trying to retreat for a little while. The reason why I didn't mainly was because I didn't think I would make it if I just went straight back. Just feeling.
I thought we were going in. I don't even know what killed me. Oh, that's not good. But when she gets it back, she'll be able to use it and then reuse it really, really fast. I have a feeling that Noble doesn't play this hero very much. Here, behind you, behind you! This build, by the way, it does increase Chen's tankiness over most other builds. I'm saving on to my abilities right now. Just so I can use them on her when I see her. Peel and then you go back out. That was really, really good. Whee! I lived! I almost lived again! I only noticed her when she was right next to me. Varian can outheal almost anybody with that build. Do they have a lot of spell power? Yes? Is a slow going to help us? Mm. 
Where are they? On this hero, like most others, you want to weave in auto attacks in between all of your stuff. And that is how we peel. considering that went fairly well for us. They only have one fort, and they just paid. Going to really quickly get these. Or a kill. Like, it's important to have your plans and to try to follow them through. Especially in team fights. You want to, like, picture your team fight before it happens. And then try your best to execute it. But you also have to figure out what your teammates are going to do. Well, I suppose by them being so deadlock and me not turning in. Sometimes in this build, I like, still go for the range with the Q. It's very, very useful. If anyone should have so many gems, it should be Ken. Your game.
If you're new, playing on this map, your uh, spiders only go as far as your waves do. For free. And then it takes them... Um, I'm not going to say I'm happy about that, but it costs them keep damage, and I think that's three walls. It This might be a keep, especially if he just stands there. So it's not a complete loss. Them picking a fight costs them a keep. Now, what could I have done better, if we were looking, um, when I was here? I could have just kept on peeling Valera. Instead, I tried to go after Leoric for some reason. That was a bad, bad move on my part. And that was a boneheaded move and a completely useless death. This Tracer really isn't that good. Ooh. She pushed him back the moment I tried to kill onto them. That one wasn't on me. The fact that we took top keep made that basically free. So now we just have to defend against this. If I were them, I'd be uh, going for boss right now. Our fort was destroyed. We can actually take him. Really shouldn't have died. It was a classic mistake of, um, of running away from your teammates when you panic. By the way, Still a very new hero, but I don't like that um, level 20 for D.Va. It just makes you stand still for too long. Very high risk. Oh, they're not running. Let's 
go. Can they kill me here? They can. They can definitely kill me. I just want to give what I have right now. I saw that invisible hero go down there. Ooh, that was good. Racer, you're getting way too far away from my comfort. Too late. I was. I made it! So, in team fights with this build, you kind of want to be the center of everything. Well done, friends. On the house. I'm going to stay here and get that XP. Okay, one of them show, so they can't kill me here. Or they can just go in. Whatevs. No reason to tank that. Jesus, stop running away from the team! I can wait a couple seconds here. I <sighs> can't believe I lived that. And we did some pretty nice keep damage. Pushing her away. You never push her away.
And that's how you lose a game. If Chen has one main weakness, it's he's not that useful in that level 20 team fight. Well, that, and he's a frontliner without a lot of peels, but he can do a whole lot of other things really, really well. He has a slow, but no roots or stuns. And if you look at this damage, it's really, really reliable.